An ongoing internal investigation inside Fiat Chrysler Sterling assembly plant to see who hung a noose inside a paint shop last month. It is considered racial harassment. As Nick Monticelli reports, it's not the first racially motivated problem the plant has seen. Nick. Good evening. This is the second or third issue inside of the Sterling Heights assembly plant and the police department here has investigated at least one of them, but it seems that this noose is the worst of them. The Sterling Heights assembly plant is so massive. News of what was found last month still hadn't reached everyone and workers inside aren't allowed to talk on camera, but those who knew told Local 4 they are offended and disgusted that a racist problem like this happened inside of their plant. The noose was found hanging in a paint shop at the Sterling Heights assembly plant last month. In a statement, FCA leaders said the incident at the Sterling Heights assembly plant in February was the subject of an exhaustive investigation conducted by external investigators. Although we have been unable to identify the person responsible, if and when that person is identified, the relationship with the company will be terminated. The vice president of the UAW4 FCA says we are appalled at these reports. It is always unacceptable when a member suffers the indignity of slurs based on race, gender, religion or sexual orientation. The UAW has been and will always be a leader in fighting discrimination in the workplace. One day after the noose was found, the local UAW made a Facebook post urging workers to speak up, saying fear mongering through race based attacks and antics should not and will not be tolerated at Shaft. The post also referenced other similar racial incidents in the past few months, and the Sterling Heights Police Department investigated at least one, which turned out to be a former employee, and FCA decided to handle that matter internally. If FCA determines who hung the news, and if they contact Sterling Heights PD, that person could face ethnic intimidation charges. In Sterling Heights, Nick Monticelli, Local 4.